So like, I was on a dating app called OkCupid and I found myself a real gem of a profile. This chick is 43 years old, she's a stay-at-home mother, and she used to be a dancer. Now when she says dancer, I don't think she means tap dancer or ballerina, right? Judging by what she's wearing to the pool here, it looks like she's got a lot of strip club attire still, right? And if you look at this next picture, it says her age, 43, but she could totally pass for 63. I mean, look at that. She totally hit the wall really bad. She's wearing glasses. She's trying to reinvent herself as, like, sophisticated now. And if you look in the background, you'll see, like, a cross. And then you look up here, you see the word faith. And, uh, it's funny because I use the word faith and fate in, like, all my videos. So it's sort of ironic, right? Uh, somebody's trying to redeem themselves from a really bad pastor, it looks like. And then if you look at this picture, she's with her actual son in the picture in their studio apartment that looks like crap. And, uh, I don't know, it looks like somebody didn't set up a retirement fund when they were stripping because, I mean, what chick in their 20s actually thinks about the future? Like, none of them. I mean, this is the whole reason why she's on OkCupid, okay because she wants to marry up some dude that'll bail, bail her out of this crap, right? Okay, here's the good part. Here's her actual bio. Now, I'm gonna try to read this, because her grammar really sucks, so just bear with me here. Okay, I'm a stay-at-home mom now. I used to be a dancer for eight of my ten-year marriage. I hated it, but I had two young kids at the time, two and three-year-old, and I wanted off welfare to make it worse. I didn't know at the time what a lazy man I married. I've worked other jobs after being a dancer. It was very humbling. I learned what I truly prioritize. Now for the last five years, I've been on SSI for PTSD. It's a long story. Let's just say I took a pay cut for my sanity. Dang, that's one hell of a crazy story right there, huh? Okay, so like what I gathered from what she tried to say was something like, she was with some loser dude in her 20s and 30s. You know, the stereotypical loser that didn't work and he was lazy and he was probably forcing her to strip and he was maybe abusive and I don't know, like she claimed it was a nightmare and stuff. But I mean, from the guy's perspective, that's gotta be like heaven on earth right there. Can you imagine being married to a stripper and not having to work? You just stay home all day and freaking smoke weed and sleep sleep in? I mean, that's 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 gotta be freaking awesome. And when she comes home from work, she strips for you. She's a freaking stripper. I mean, they probably had a freaking stripper pole in their apartment. I, <laughs> I couldn't imagine a better freaking life. I mean, this guy is one lucky sucker right here. Damn. You see, years ago, back in her prime, her loser ex-boyfriend was basically getting paid to give a stripper orgasms every night. I mean, Jesus, that's gotta be the best job on the planet. And this guy probably gave her some pretty big mind-blowing orgasms. I mean, they were so good that she was giving him money to stay at home and do that all day and do nothing. I mean, like, think about that. That's... <laughs> That's heaven on earth right there. And here's like the best part of her profile. So this is what she's actually looking for on the site. And she wrote down, I am searching for the love of my life. I'm looking to get married within a year or two. I'm so tired of these games. I do not want any players, serious men only. I do not date boys. I only date men, swipe left, and do not message me if you are a boy. But yeah. That, that uh, she wants to get married now. I mean, she's 43 and she can't strip and she didn't set up a retirement fund, so she's looking for that Stephen A. Poindexter type, right? That's gonna wife her up. And, uh, do you think, like, you think if she got with a Stephen A. Poindexter type, she's gonna strip for him? I don't think there'll be any stripping or anything like that for him. Uh, all her good stuff went to this guy. So, yeah. I don't know, uh, I don't think it's a good deal. I'm gonna swipe left on that.